Hello, my dear lovelies. It is Drina, and look at me. I am sweating like nobody's business. Now, listen, I don't know if it is the weather. It feels muggy. However, I was used to have hot flashes. Uh, maybe it started about five years ago, and then they stopped. And now it, it's coming back. Now, I don't, like I said, I don't know if it's the weather or if it's just me. And I am literally sweating 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 so uh, in a previous video i had showed that i got i was like taking a break from the wigs because they were making me way too hot with the stocking cap and then the wig and then all of that so this here my dears is a um a half wig where i don't have to um have no stocking cap or anything on i have my hair in two french braids and then i just you know stick this little thing on so it's not the wig making me uh sweat or hot um but just pray for me i am going through the peri menopause meaning that i have to have one entire year of no cycle which is not happening it's coming and going so it's skipping maybe three or four months and then when it comes it's coming like niagara falls i know that's by tmi but it is real it is real it is real so if you are in that age frame and you are in the age frame i mean like 40 starting at maybe 40 and then on up i'm now 50 i think i'm 51 <laughs> i might be 52 i don't remember i was born in 1972 but right now the um the sweat is just beyond me. I can barely even wear makeup. So I've decided that I am just going to wear eyebrows and a little eyeliner and um, maybe lashes on some days, some days not. So pray my strength as I'm going through this change, as I pray your strength, if you're going through the change, comment below. Tell me if there's any of you that's going through this and what are you doing to um, alleviate the sweating. I don't want to take the other medications that they are um, trying to give me. I really don't like taking medications like that. So I know there are some natural and more healthy and safe alternatives. If you have any, please comment below. Look, I'm sweating all in the neck. That's so unattractive. All right, I will talk to y'all later. I'm going to check on Curtis. Just picked him up from the hospital. He had his procedures done today, a colonoscopy, and then a gastro something somethingoscopy. They did find one polyp, and they did remove it to God be the glory. I've been running between households, between my son household, him and his fiance, who's pregnant. She's scheduled to have her C-section, um, I believe, at the end of this month. They both tested positive for COVID. So let's pray their strength physically, mentally, uh, spiritually, emotionally, um, because they do also have the two-year-old, my glam babe. You've seen her on some of my videos and they're trying their best to do their best to stay safe and healthy. So prayers up for my son here at the household. Shade, uh, once again, I tested her yesterday. She She's still testing positive. So she's quarantined in her room and um it's just been a struggle trying to run back and forth between households take care of you know curtis and take care of them and then try to take some time out to take care of myself and make sure i'm testing um negative um and I, we don't run out of all the COVID tests so i need to run and um, hopefully can find some more tests somewhere you know so we can continue to test at home so far curtis and myself are testing negative Shade still positive <clears throat> my son's still positive and his um, pregnant fiance is still positive so prayers for them as well yes and also uh prayers for a couple of blocks away on uh, jacinto and calvine that is probably about two minutes from my house and then two minutes from my son's house coming the other way there's a standoff there's a man in a house with a gun prayers for that situation that uh it turns out that nobody gets killed and that that person gets to hell. i'm good you good yeah y'all trying to put me on bird diet i'm like forget that
Huh. I got to eat eventually. I started it for like two and a half or a day and a half. I started it. I watched y'all from Popeye's. <laughs> I know you got a story and you just don't want to wait. Adrena's Haven 916, you know we can relate. Adrena's Haven 916. Adrena's Haven 916.